Hey guys, it's me. I'm getting on the scale. Here we go. There it is. Hi everyone. Welcome to PETA's journey. Um, so today I went and got weighed. It's been almost two weeks since I got weighed last. Um, and I gained weight. I have gone four pounds in the last two weeks. I'm not sure what I've done different or what I haven't done right. Um, and I've came up with many different thoughts and excuses in my mind. Uh, maybe it's water weight. Um, maybe... Maybe I haven't done enough exercises. That's probably it. Um, <laughs> maybe, maybe I ate wrong. I, I, I don't think I did though. I, I didn't eat any different than I normally do. Um, so I'm, I'm not sure. And I can come up with all these excuses, um, but that's not going to do me any good. Um, and I could be depressed, which I am a little sad. I will admit. Um, it's kind of defeating when you try so hard and then you don't lose weight. Um, but I kind of suspected that I, I'd probably gained weight just if you know how you feel. Um, and I have to remember that weight does fluctuate. So maybe, maybe that's it. Or maybe I just put on four pounds because I, didn't do something right and I just need to face that and that's that's okay too. I mean it's not okay that I put on weight. It means I need to try harder and work harder. Um but I have to remember it's not the end of the world. And uh I've lost those four pounds before, so I can do it again. And I'm just going to stay positive and remember that I I can do it again but it's it's hard and it feels very defeating and you're probably wondering why is she crying at me on camera because you're not the only one who goes through it I want you to know you're not alone in all those emotions when you get on that scale and you see that you've gained weight <laughs> and it hurts um It's, it's not the end of the world and you can lose weight and I, I can continue losing weight. I can do this. I just have to keep trying. I have to try harder and I'm going to. So wish me luck with this. <laughs> um, like I said, yes, I'm, I'm a little sad today, but I'm going to stay positive and uh, okay. And I'm not going to cry <laughs> anymore. Um, and no matter what excuse I come up with, it's not going to change the fact that I've put on those four pounds. So I just have to stay strong, keep trying, stay focused, and continue with my journey. Now, I will say it. A few minutes ago, you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to order pizza. Now, I'm not saying that pizza is bad for you. Like, technically, it has, like, all the food groups. Um, but it's probably not really that good for you. I mean, I don't put meat on my pizza anymore and stuff. But, uh, it's still not the best. But, you know why I wanted to do that? I wanted to do it because I felt sad. So I wanted to eat and comfort that sad feeling to make me feel better. And um, I decided, no, I'm, I'm not going to do that. So I don't, I don't need to eat junk food. That's not going to make me feel better. In fact, that's going to make me feel worse. And, you know... I did eat junk food in the last two weeks, and that that is different, actually. That is the one thing that is different. I did eat junk food, 
and maybe my body can't handle any amounts of junk food. Um, so I did. Remember I had those honey buns, honey bunnies as I call them. Three days in a row I ate, I ate a total of six honey bunnies. So there is no excuse. No matter if I was sad throughout this last week and that's why I did it, I know better now. I know that I have an eating disorder in where I get sad and I eat. I get stressed and I eat. And I know the proper things to eat now and when to keep my mouth shut for once. Um, and not eat, uh, when I'm going to just stress eat, but I, I didn't pay attention to that. And instead I just ate. So this is on me. I caused myself to gain four pounds. Lesson learned. I definitely don't need to be eating six honey bunnies. At any point. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, lessons today would be to stop eating junk food. <laughs> and you won't gain four pounds. So, um, you guys, thank you for coming on this journey with me. And this journey is going to continue. And I am going to do this. I am going to lose this weight. I am determined. I am trying to be healthy in body and mind. And I'm going to stay positive. And if you're on this journey with me, that's wonderful. And you know what? You can do it too. I believe in you. Thanks, guys. And have a wonderful rest of your day. And stay safe. Bye-bye. Hey guys, just one more quick little note. Um, I'm sorry if I sound contradictory in the video. Um, at first, I had forgotten about me eating the honey bunnies. Um, and so when I remembered it, I, I needed to say it. I needed you guys to know um, that I, I was taking full responsibility for my actions that caused me to have this reaction to me gaining weight. So I wanted to make sure to share that with you. Um, and I could have cut it out, but I'm not going to. Um, I want you guys to see my emotions and see me. Um, because not everybody will put that out there. Uh, their real emotions and and then you feel like oh am I normal for feeling that feeling or is it wrong to feel this way you know what any feelings that you're having isn't wrong they're your feelings you can have them and it doesn't make it right or wrong if you have a feeling that's different from somebody else so um, I just wanted to put that out there and let you know that I wasn't trying to be count uh, What's that word again? Well, you get my point. I, I contradictory. Um, and the other thing is, I, I I'm sorry that my phone dings sometimes in the middle of me filming, and when it's um, something really good, like I'm really catching my emotions on camera for you guys, and or telling you something that I think is very important, I don't want to take that out. So I'm going to try to figure out how not to have that ding happen. Um, maybe I just need to mute my phone. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Anyways, um, so I just wanted to say those couple things. Um, but I hope you guys have an amazing evening and stay safe. Bye-bye.